Making an Eco-Friendly Garden Our English teacher was fond of telling stories. When he told us the story of the Israeli people who changed the barren land into a beautiful garden, we couldn't believe it. But now, sitting on the stone benches amidst the greenery in our school or walking in the shade of the gooseberry trees, we can't believe it is our school campus. We feel as if we are in a park. Our science teacher gave us an assignment in science. It was to collect as many bougainvillea stems as we could and to plant them in polythene covers. When they grew, we were asked to write the color of each flower on a piece of paper and attach the labels to the plant. We never thought that it would grow since we kept it on the top of the terrace without proper care. After a month, our teacher opened the terrace doors we eagerly went to see our plants. To our wonder and surprise, all the bougainvillea cuttings had begun to produce young shoots. We knew that we hadn't watered the plants. Then who had been watering the plants all these days? We asked. The school attendant said, I had seen your teacher and your principal watering the plants all these days. We planted all the bougainvillea in our designed plot and they began to grow fast. It was really a wonderful sight when all the plants bloomed at the same time. Later, we constructed an arch frame with iron pipes and the plants climbed on the iron structure. Now, when we enter the school gates, the bougainvillea garden welcomes us. It looks so nice and attractive. This experience fostered our team spirit. Later, we planted shoe flower plants, gooseberry bushes, techi, mandaram, a variety of bamboo trees, yellow palms, red palms, ashoka trees, teak, marudu, venga, konna, etc. Making use of the collections from parents and with the active participation of students, we have done a lot of gardening activities at a cost of 7 lakhs, said the coordinators of the Bhumitra Sena Club of our school. Lots of people come to the garden to spend their leisure time enjoying the beauty of nature. More than a dozen sparrows have made their nests on the branches of the trees that we planted and they find peace and tranquility in the lap of nature, said the student leader of the Eco Club. We are happy that these activities of a school have been suggested as a model for the preservation of biodiversity.